model engines is set in a world that we have never seen. It's a wonderfully imagined world that has been realized by Peter Jackson and his team. The breath of vision that they brought to Lord of the Rings, they're going to bring the same to mortal engines. The cities are actually moving their traction cities, they're massive. The big cities ingest smaller towns, and London is one of the biggest. They are on a mission to hunt down another town. At the heart of this story is Hester. When we first see Hester, she's this mysterious, feral badass. Hester is on a mission to exact vengeance and kill the person who murdered her mother. She'd like to live in a world where there's one less person in it. Valentine. And that's Valentine. <laughs> this is for my mother. Of course, things don't go according to plan. Hey, stop! Ah! Mortal Engines is the story of two people crashing into each other. Oh! Ask him why you murdered my mother. It is about the characters and their journey beyond the hand that fate has dealt them. Tom and Hester are forced into a situation where they have to rely on each other to survive. I just think it's awesome that we have a character like Hester Shaw, who is so wild and so driven. Hester Shaw, she won't stop until I'm dead. And action! There were so many moments of pure joy working in such a fantastical world. Your mother, she had found something dangerous. We had the chance to write a really great mystery. The size and the scope and the imagination of this thing. I'm going to be as amazed by this movie as the audience are. The man who controls this, controls the world. Not if we shut it down. It's about something bigger than just her revenge. You sure you want to do this? I have to. For me, I always want to imagine I'm going to spend two years producing a movie. There's got to be something I have never seen. 